I think it's I think it's any time any time a champion can force your ult quickly. Any time a champion can force your ult with burst, it's Bork Jock Show. Straight up. No, I don't use Bork all the time. I use Bork some of the time. Normally, I want to snowball. I want to go like Gale Force Essence Reaver with a lead and just fucking ruin everybody's life. But if I'm facing champs that, like I said, can 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 threaten 100 and 0 like a Talon, this seems to be a way better build. That game, that game, the Renekton was there, right? So I could walk up to the Renekton, slap him in the forehead. You saw what he did, right? He throws his whole combo on me, ults. I didn't even have to ult. I just go, okay, cool. And then I Q and back away from it, wait it out, and then resume. It's like flipping, it's like flipping the whole situation on its head. I think it's really good. I think it's a really good build. To put it into perspective, I was behind the entire game, but I tanked that much fucking damage. And I made a really good flank that saved the game. Dude, I may, I may just start running that build. I'm so convinced. I'm so convinced that it's legit. I guess, I guess there's a time and a place, but... Dude, it makes Trinomir actually do Trinomir things. He can actually, like, fucking fight. He can hit shit. And if you're really, really good with your ult timings with it, you're just unkillable, man. It's crazy. Zero percent win rate, diamond three. A good thing I've seen all the bullshit already on this server, so... But I gotta look at this again real quick before I run this game. Cause I, I'm pretty sure my E didn't hit a single... I didn't get a single minion with my E. Look at that. Like, what are the chances of this? What are the chances of this shit? My E did not hit a single fucking minion. A champion's actually useless before level 3, too. Because once he has his Q, that changed the whole fight. Look. See? That changed the whole fight. Because if he doesn't have his... Basically, the idea is that I'm allowed to fuck with him here. And kite down. But my E doesn't hit a single... Kill. I just set it up for him. Oh, boy. If I just waited a second and then Eid, it would have been fine. It would have been great. He would have got level three. And then I could have just autoed him through and then kite the rumble away. That's just so gross. <laughs> so gross. And then right here, see, if I'm not, if he's not able to CC me, then I could have... Basically, I would have been able to just auto rumble or auto Sejuani and move down here. Mid pushes out and then I could just kite around this fucking plant or whatever. Too many accounts in this game though, for real. There's a damn Zeri with three, or I'm sorry, a diamond three Zeri with zero wins on the champion. Oh wait, no, she won one recently. Never mind. Oh, only when duoing though. Yeah, only when duoing. As per usual with these fucking losers. Duo abuse only. Chat, wake up, noobs. Also, Nathan, thanks for subbing, man.
쉬운 사냥이 되겠군. 전쟁으로. 적을 처치해. 오, 아가 라운 We actually have a real jungler this game that knows how to play the mid. mid. Like, this, this guy, I should just duo with him, but... Obviously, you can't duo the master tier, but...
<clears throat> Bruh. This poor talent's getting dookied on. Vicious outplay, dude. I love getting backseat gamed by a support player. <clears throat> yeah, I'm gonna go Bork into immediate jock show. Come on, 
Turret touches. Turret touches me. the thing I gave Caitlyn a shutdown, which isn't good. I wasn't thinking about Caitlyn ult at all. Oh, 
He <laughs> he <clears throat> yeah, this build This build with a lead feels pretty safe
박재기를 파괴했습니다. 포탑을 파괴했습니다. 전쟁으로. 지지. 아, um, I t h i n 까지 30초 남았습니다. I saw him doing that and I was like I was like, "Oh man, I can I can invade with this guy." I'm probably calling it for the day, but I'm going to do another big session tomorrow. So, we'll have plenty of games tomorrow. Look at this play. Dude, look at this fucking This is what's supposed to happen in these fucking games. Do you understand? This is the type of shit that I'm wanting from junglers and I get annoyed when they're not doing anything. You guys see what I mean? Shove wave two. Jungler's invading because he got the vision. He knows he can go to this side. Not every jungler can invade early, but Jarvan can. But just about any jungler can invade at level three, right? This Jarvan sees it, goes, cool. I can do some shit with this, right? I move over to Sejuani. Which, honestly, in hindsight, was a mistake. I made a mistake. Because I didn't even realize he could cross like that. He just fucking crossed over. He just crossed over. If I went to the left, they would have been hurting. And then my Jarvan finds Sejuani in jungle. Like a god. Like a legend. He fucking stole the thing too. This kid. He literally steals the red too. That ends the game. This is what I mean when I say like aggro wins. Being aggro fucking wins, man. Gendrick, that's dope. Barry, are you home? Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna get offline. I'm gonna go for a run. I will be on tomorrow. Uh, I'm not playing for the rest of the night. Thanks for being here. I'm out. Peace.